It's your boy Warlow back with another my team video. And we are going to review the new rush cards that are coming this week. So let's check it out. Let's see what's coming out. Boom. Let's see what they tweet one minute ago. Galaxy Opal Dennis Rodman. Oh no. Ew. Another small forward is crazy. Another week, another small forward. I told people this, like they were gatekeeping centers like a lot because they don't want to take away from the Wimbies and a lot of the 100 overalls are centers. But bruh, y'all giving us another small four. How many small fours do I need? I can run a full lineup of just small forwards at this point. James Worthy, Dennis Rodman, Danny Granger. There's a fourth small forward that's just not even hitting my head. Wiggins, how many small forwards do we freaking need? Come on, man. These batch of cards stink. I'm just being honest. I'm, I'm, ju I'm just being... Actually, Bruce Bowen might be all right. Bruce Bowen, actually, but he's going to have... We're going to go review the six. You know, I like to check out each player's release, but we'll go on 2KDB real quick. Dennis Robin wasn't bad before, but like... We got so many good small forwards now. Like, why would you go back to Dennis Rodman? He's going to have updated SIGs, motion style, stuff of that nature. I mean, Dennis Rodman was a good, all right card, I guess. I mean, he was all right. But he was nothing that special, really. Like, Dennis Rodman was cool. Like, I'll probably get normal leaner updated. Like, I, I, I liked his diamond, actually. But it's just like... Do we need a small? Honestly, is Andrew is, is he gonna be better than like Andrew Wiggins? Like, I mean, like I'm just being real. Like Andrew Wiggins, he's better than Granger. I mean, any guy's better than Granger. Let's not let's not get that twisted. Anybody's better than Twi <laughs> is better than Granger at this stage in the game. Literally every single body. But Bruce Bowen might will be good though. It just. He's not going to get updated SIGs, so it's like, it is what it is with that. Like, he's going to have pro SIGs, not good SIGs. Like, he's going to be a good defensive player. If he got updated animations, he'd actually be really good. Monte Ellis is a garbage can. Like, they probably will update Monte Ellis. I'm just going to assume they will. Like, they did Darren Williams, but, like, nobody asking for it. I mean, people, like, people want Russell Westbrook. How about do a Westbrook card? And if you're going to give us Monte, I mean... Pro Dribble 6, good lord, if this don't get updated. I think he's going to get updated. I don't think Richard Hamilton's going to get updated, but this might be one of the worst rush week. The fourth worst rush week, you know? The, the fourth worst. Richard Hamilton, has he had a card all year? Richard Hamilton, yeah, he had a card in season one. But, like, his six aren't, hey, and a Pro 2 laner's nice. That's actually nice to have off the get-go. That's actually quite nice. But, I mean, none of these cards are gassing or hyping me up, though. But let's hop on the game and let's go test out some of these releases and see what these players are about. Okay, so I got all the jump shots on very quick for y'all. That's what I do on here. So to check the real... I don't like that release even on very quick. Like, I don't know about Dennis Robin. He's going to be a solid defender. But I'm just trying to think, why in the world would you use Dennis Robin over James Worthy? This is what this is the issue is 2K when y'all give players with the same position. Like you can't give us one great like uh, I don't know a shooting guard, a center. I mean, I guess they gave us Wiggins, but an actual shooting guard, a center. A, I don't know something more interesting. It's like I'm sorry, but nobody want to use Dennis Rodman, man. Like I don't know, maybe Dennis Rodman's gonna shock me and he's gonna be him, or he's gonna be goaded in my team, but I just don't see it. When we got cards like LeBron running around, like Worth, let's just say non gamma, like Worthy's gonna be way better. It's just, why would anyone use this release and have it? Like, it's not like he's gonna get like amazing tendencies. Like, let's check his tendencies real quick. It's not like Dennis Rodman's gonna get cracked out. Does he have cracked out tendencies, maybe? Yeah, he doesn't even have cracked out. He has 99 charge, but he doesn't even have cracked out tendos. So it's kind of just like, it's so massively disappointing with Dennis Rodman. I'm not, I'm not seeing it. I think it'll be decent, like, all right. No behind the back. He'd probably get, though, updated. But 
Man, Dennis Rodman is a snoozy. Like, I'm going to sleep over here. Like, I'm out here about to be knocked out. Like, Rush got me just, man, that's supposed to be Rush. I must be rushing to my bed because, good lord, this thing got me sleeping. Okay, we got Richard Hamilton up next. I mean, all right, I guess. I mean, if they can, you know, I don't know. Like, nothing. He's better. Like, it's just, he's all right. Like, Dennis, if you've been waiting for a Richard Hamilton card, I don't think they're going to update his SIGs. I think they're just going to update Monte Ellis' SIGs. It would be nice if they did update him. But, personally speaking, I'm just not pro dribble style. Doesn't really move particularly that great, really. Doesn't really have that great of movement. He's all right, though. I guess if you're a Rachel Hamilton fan, oh, go stab him up. But, like, let's be real. How many people you play on my team use Richard Hamilton? Exactly nobody. Nobody. His really looks similar to Bruce Bowen's. Isaiah Ryder has LeBron release on normal, so that that's nice. Like, y'all want to, if you just want to use a, the same jump shot as LeBron, well, then you got Isaiah Ryder. Except without, you know, all the qualities that make LeBron good, you know? So he's all right. Just has LeBron James shot. Let's take the leaner, though, on him. I mean, that leaner is, I don't know what leaner that is. What leaner? What leaner is that? That leaner's pro free. Pro free leaner. Um, I don't know how. Don't know how I feel about pro free leaner. I mean, man, I don't like it. I'm just being honest. I don't like his leaner. His shot is fine. Like, don't get it wrong. LeBron's shot on normal is still a hittable, easy release. But I feel like he's just gonna lack too much, and yeah, not be that good. Not be that. Not be. Not be that guy. Next up, we got Bruce Bowen, which I think I'm the most intrigued by is Bruce Bowen, which is sad. I shouldn't be more intrigued by Bruce Bowen. Because Bruce Bowen has an all right jump shot. He's going to have great defense. But the same thing goes for Bruce Bowen. Why would I use Bruce Bowen over Amari Cooper? You, you see what I mean? Like, if I'm a person that grinded Rush and kept it up with all the grinds, why in the world would I use Bruce Bowen over Amari Cooper that's going to provide me more? Amari Cooper. I say Amari Cooper. I meant... Whatever, his Michael Cooper. Oh, I mean, I keep saying Amari Cooper. Michael Cooper. Amari Cooper. He's literally going to be better than all the cards I can get, right? Like, all, all the cards. So, it's like, what what are we doing? Like, they're not going to change a single animation on this card. So, yeah, I just, I just, I just, I just don't know, man. Like, Amari Cooper is going to be better than Bruce Bowen, so... There's no point of getting excited about Bruce Bowen, to be quite honest. Like, he's not all that good, really. He's all right, I guess, but mm, just, I think he'll be all, it'll be all right. You, you get him, you'll like him, but like, he's not going to be bad, but just use Amari Cooper. And next up, we got Monte Ellis. I think like they have to update him. There's, there's no chance to keep this, right? There's no way to keep Monte Ellis with this slow shot. There's just... I'm just going to assume there's no way they're actually going to keep Monte. I feel like they're going to make Monte Ellis really, really good. But like I mentioned before, like, drop Westbrook, man. Westbrook hasn't gotten a card since how long? A lot of, I know a lot of people like Russell Westbrook. And when the last time he got a card? He got a card, like, on December 1st. So you already know they're going to put him behind the gambling. And you're going to have to gamble for Russell Westbrook. You just know. Just know they're going to do that, probably. Instead of giving him for free. Like, I'd rather have Russell Westbrook Galaxy Opal, and at least people are excited today to hop on the game and get their Russell Westbrook than a Dennis Rodman that's not going to generate any hype in the game. It's like, 2K, can we actually get something that's going to generate hype buzz in this game, man? Like, something just, just hype in the mode, please. But, yeah, I'm just... I honestly don't think this grind is worth it. So you gotta look at six tomorrow stuff. I will grind it for y'all because I want I want to show y'all the guard, make sure he's good or not. Maybe they surprise me, but I'm just not seeing it with Robin. I don't see a world where he's better than James Worthy or any of this. Like he's better. Than, like I mentioned before, he's better than Granger. Granger is one of the worst opals in the game though, so you can't really compare any card to him. But Dennis Robin. He's a little bit of a, just a straight snoozy. But yeah, us that actually grind the game, we get jumpers like this. And ones that spend a ton of money, they get Quran Artest level jumpers. But yeah, are you excited for this rush? Are you going to sleep? Or you have a teddy bear next to you? Let me know in the comment section. 
Honestly, like, would you rather write on a chalkboard than grind this? I don't know. I, I don't know. But see y'all in the next time my team video. Keep